She's the biggest recording artist in the world, and people are accusing her of having had plastic surgery. She looks like she's had a brow lift, upper eyelid surgery, a rhinoplasty, and lip fillers. So has Taylor Swift really had plastic surgery? Well, I'm a real plastic surgeon, and on this video, we're gonna go year after year and look at Taylor to see whether she may have had some work done. And throughout that process, I'm gonna tell you what she has admitted to having done and why she says she looks so fantastic, and we'll end with my recommendations on how you can look as great as Taylor as you get older. I need to start this video by stating that I am not Taylor's doctor and everything I say here in this video is just my opinion as a real board certified plastic surgeon. So let's start with Taylor at the young age of 17. This is who I believe is the natural Taylor Swift and she had just gotten in the spotlight. She's a young and rising star and she's a beautiful young woman. Now pay close attention to her eyes and her nose and her chin. These are three areas that people have accused her of going under the knife and changing. So this is how she looks at the age of 17. Let's fast forward one year to the age of 18. So as you can see in this photo, Taylor looks about the same. So no real changes from the age of 17 to 18. And a year later, you can see at the age of 19, she also looks pretty much the same. No obvious plastic surgery here. Let's fast forward to the age of 20. Well, Taylor is a huge star, and you can see at the age of 20, she looks basically the same as she did the year before. No obvious plastic surgery at all here. And now here she is at the age of 21. She looks naturally beautiful like the Taylor Swift that we know. And even at the age of 22, I'm just seeing nothing. Like she just looks naturally like Taylor with no obvious signs of work done. But then the age of 23 comes up and she does look a little bit different. Her face does look like it's getting a bit leaner and some people have accused her of undergoing a buckle fat pad removal to help narrow and thin her cheeks. Now it's possible that she's had this done, but it's also possible that she just has gotten a little bit leaner and she's getting a little bit older. And as we get older, our face does typically lean out a bit. Now at the age of 24, she once again looks the same as she did a year before, having a little bit of that leaner appearance, maybe due to surgery, but probably not. Now here she is at the age of 25. Some people may say that she may have had some injections in her lips, but I would say it's probably just lip lining and not necessarily lip injections. And here she is at the age of 26, also looking pretty much the same. And this is where things may have changed a bit. She kind of disappeared from public view for the entire year of 2017. I was not able to find any photographs of her back then, and this is when some people believe that she may have undergone a nose job. So let's take a peek at her a year later in 2018 at the age of 28. This is when some experts have speculated that Taylor Swift underwent a nose job. They say that her nose looks a little bit more refined and a little bit shorter, a little smaller. Eh, it's possible, and if that nose job was done, it was very, very subtle. If I had to make a guess, I would say that she probably did not have a nose job. So if she did have a nose job, once again, it was very subtly done, very tasteful, and really, really hard to spot, even from an expert. I've done nose jobs for 10 years, and it's a tough one to say. I can call a lot of fake noses, but with hers, it's not obvious. So before we continue on to looking at her present day, what has Taylor said that she has had done to look so fantastic? She does a lot of things holistically to keep herself looking and feeling healthy. And the first thing is that she moisturizes every night. Now moisturizing technically is not gonna make you look younger or even necessarily slow down the aging process, but it can keep your skin looking nice and smooth and hydrated. Speaking of hydration, she's also said in an interview that she drinks 10 bottles of water every day and she avoids sugary drinks. Now sugar is one of the biggest agers of our body through the process of glycation and through inflammation. And so avoiding sugary drinks is a great way to slow down the aging process and to prevent premature aging of the skin. And while Taylor says that she loves a Starbucks coffee every morning, she saves the sugary Starbucks drinks just for the weekends as weekend treats. Now Taylor Swift, to my knowledge, has never gone on record of admitting to having any type of cosmetic procedure done. 
whether it's Botox, fillers, or plastic surgery, she's definitely not admitted to having a nose job either. So now let's fast forward to the age of 29, and you can see that Taylor Swift kind of looks the same. She is getting older, her face overall has gotten a bit leaner, but once again, this is very common as we age. I see that happen with my own face. Now, I wasn't able to obtain any photographs of her from the year 2020 because, like most of us, she was kind of hanging out and I think she was doing a lot of recording that year. And 2021, also, I was not able to get any photographs. But here are a couple of photographs of her from the year 2022. Now, these are concert photographs, and once again, I'm not seeing any obvious plastic surgery. She hasn't had a ton of filler to fill out her cheeks as her cheeks look fairly lean. Her lips appear to have retained the same shape as they have always had. So if we take a look at her lips from 2022 and we compare them to when she was only 17 years old back in 2007, the overall shape of her lips appear to be about the same. Her nose also doesn't appear to have changed much, if at all. Corporate needs you to find the differences between this picture and this picture. They're the same picture. So once again, I'm really not seeing a whole lot of plastic surgery in her. Maybe a nose job, but uh, it's tough to say. And her lack of obvious surgical changes has continued through this year as well as she has been on her massive tour. So how can you look and age as gracefully as Taylor Swift? Well, here are four very simple tips that can help you look as young as Taylor as you get older. The first thing is to eat plenty of fruits and vegetables. Different colored fruits and vegetables are filled with antioxidants that can help fight free radicals in oxidation and slow down the aging process. The second thing is to use sunscreen, at least an SPF 30, especially if you're outside. The third thing is to treat your skin every night with a skincare product that actively fights aging. For most people, a retinol works fantastic. For those of you who are sensitive to the effects of retinol, you may wanna try one with Bakuchiol, as Bakuchiol based creams can have very similar effects anti-aging wise as retinol. And the fourth thing that you may wanna try is red light therapy. Red light therapy can often be done in the comfort of your own home, and these red light treatments can help fight the aging process. This is something that I bet Taylor can easily do when she's on tour and traveling around the country and around the world. Well, Taylor Swift has the most popular concert tour in the country, but who has one of the most popular movies right now? It's Margot Robbie. Take a peek at what I think Margot Robbie has had done plastic surgery wise, and whether she has truly become a human Barbie doll. And remember, eat real food, use clean skincare, and auto-juvenate before you operate.